Hey there, welcome back to my channel. I am Jenna, this channel. It's all about my 4C, 4B-ish natural hair journey. So if you are into sort of thing, you're looking for like DIYs, reviews, how to all those things for natural 4b 4c here then you are here right if you are here, new to my channel this <laughs> thank you very much for stopping by oh i greet you and if you are a returning subscriber hey sis what's up what's popping thank you so much for your support i see you on if any one of you have a question on hair or anything else or specific on this video that you're about to watch just go ahead on the comment section ask me anything i always go through my comment section and i respond to everyone and also if you feel like you want to connect more with me you can dm me on instagram i also always uh, answer there as well i don't like slicking my my edges down and all those stuff so if you want to know how i personally did this without slicking my edges down and all those things you better stick by and continue watching in this following video which you are gonna see i will be introducing to you a specific product so before i play in that video let me tell you a little bit more about this product it's a hair butter which i'm about to show you which looked like this flux hair reached out to me via instagram and asked me if i want to try their hair butter soften and moisturizes hair dull and brittle hair hair adding a natural shine with a chia butter base for curly relaxed and kinky hair it's like 150 ml um it's hand mail all natural and it smells absolutely amazing I look like this i've used it twice if you know guys know i always like to try the product first before i introduce it to you guys so this is the second time i'm using it so i created this hairstyle which you're gonna see in a few minutes okay um so it looks like this it smells absolutely amazing i have used a chair butter in the past before like a few months ago and i actually didn't really like that that much i like this this is like a mixture of chair butter and different oils and other butters like mango butter stuff like that so i think that's why i like this one more the other one was just like pure chia butter and i didn't like the scent of that that much the directions is like section hair and apply to damp hair come through with a wire to comb style as desired do not wash out that's all they also write it here in german in case someone like you know don't understand english that are basically all they are called flux hair the lady she's i think her main the main thing that she do is like um she do wigs and we stuff like that so if you guys are interested in checking them out i'm gonna put her instagram and her website on the description box so make sure you check that out this is a very huge bottle though and the following video which you're gonna see i use a lot of this so this is meant to help you to detangle your hair so that it's easier for you to go through yes indeed i was really like looking forward to that because she said yeah um i see you have like your very kinky hair curly hair uh do you mind trying my product i believe they may help you like to to detangle your hair i was like well why not i'm gonna try it and indeed it was so i started with a fresh washed hair that i did a few days ago and it just tied it up and i went ahead to spray it back with water and use this butter so so that's it. Let me just shut my mouth, play in the video, and then we see each other like in a few minutes, okay? Before we start, let me show you what you're gonna need. You are going to need a hair butter. Then a bottle with warm water, wet coat comb, separation comb, a hairbrush some bobby pins a hair tie and a few molly hair go ahead and section your hair 
into the size that you want spray it with water in case your freshly washed hair is already dry massage the water in and then apply your hair butter be gentle with your hair just like massage it really carefully and use your i use my thumb and my fingers to kind of already go through and detangle my hair and then i followed up with my white tooth comb by starting from the tip of my hair and then working myself towards the root if you do this you merely gonna almost like barely gonna um lose hair by first detangling with your fingers and then going ahead with the white tooth comb after that you just want to go step by step add your molly hair into your hair and twist as loose as possible i kind of like i wanted mine to be a little bit looser but it's okay next time i'm gonna do that uh you want to repeat these steps all over your head until you are done with your entire hair you see how gentle i'm going through my hair i'm taking my time like to detangle and by applying the molly hair i'm not like putting any pressure on my scalp i'm doing it as loose as possible for me well the reason why i choose to use molly hair is because i was trying to create like this locks look after i'm done i hope you guys will be able to see what i what i mean by tying it up i wanted to have like this kind of like not that sleek look not that like messy look kind of in between this i just wanted it to be this way so i hope you guys gonna like it look at my definition i mean oh my <sighs> and my hair have gotten so long like i feel like my hair has been growing lately very long oh jesus oh yeah by the way this is also very worked well to um separate the knots from my hair almost done this took me about 35 minutes ish so let me show you some details about it i know it still kind of look like very messy not done yet but we're gonna get there uh, you want to go ahead and add some more hair butter to your hairline and try to brush that in gentle smooth into your hair then go ahead with your hair string tie that hair up to a level where you want it you can it can be like low ponytail high ponytail kind of poof style i wanted it to be like in the middle with the poof style now let's get real look at that you can wear it as a space bun mm -hmm. no i was not trying to do that i was going for something else so you want to first like kind of like um create a hole in the middle and then go one by one by twirling twist around your hair you don't need for this in necessary a bobby pin just twirl it as long as possible like around your hair and then stick the end under your hair string you can twirl this the way you want it i did mine multiple times to get like this really the look that I just created and when you're done you want us to go ahead and maybe smooth in some baby hair that kind of loosen up while you were twirling the hair around tie it 
tied up for about i would say a minimum of 10 minutes to maximum 30 minutes take it down and then pin up some stubborn areas that didn't want it to stick down um with a few bobby pins i always needed two bobby pins like i said from the beginning i was not looking for a sleek hairstyle i was looking for exactly mm, look at me oh yeah i love it i love it well well as you just see that's how i created this hairstyle nothing crazy i use the molly twist because i want it like to last me a little bit longer and while having it like this i still have the opportunity opportunity if i wish to take the hair down re-moisturize by spraying water on it or by using butter again as i already said i did really use a lot of it so my hair should i think in the next four to five days i won't have to moisturize again because i end up using the, uh, the hair butter to seal in the moisture into my hair and this is like uh, and i do like the lco method yeah okay if you guys don't know what the lco method is <laughs> oh sis Ooh. let's chat under the comment section what else can i say about this so my final oh. i tried away i didn't mean to do that oh exactly like now behind my closet <sighs> well my final review um i like that it was very like fluffy and foamy um i know while i was applying it it does kind of look like white on my hair it's just because by while spraying the water in my hair my hair kind of cooled down and i put in that so the oil was kind of white but as soon as you leave it in like for a while you see like there's nothing white anymore it will kind of really penetrate into your hair i did like the the feeling i feel like i can use this on my skin as well because it's very very nice my, it, it doesn't feel like it's like like so early and sticky so I, I do like that and the main thing that i like is that it's, it's the scent of it smell very i can say it enough i like very natural scent when somebody passed by it smells natural but at the same time you're like mm, what was that that is exactly the scent that i like and this was kind of like giving me that vibe so that's it guys thank you very much to fox here again for sending me this hair butter to try i liked it i'm gonna keep a track on it in the next 14 days how my hair is gonna feel so if you guys want to see that i will be more active to show you guys like more behind the scene on instagram so make sure you follow me there and like just like keep connected there so everyone that's all to this video thank you very much for stopping by and watching my video i will see you guys mm, you know you know in seven days <laughs> bye